Welcome back. Well, we have Lynn Rosenstein here on behalf of the Reform Temple of Laguna Woods. Well, welcome. It's been a while. It has been. I'm glad you could make it in. Thank you. I know you guys have had lots of activities. And, of course, you're building up for the big event April 30th. And we've that been is. talking to all of our um, viewers about it. So we're really excited. And you brought some goodies today. I did. For us to taste, which is fantastic. Thank you for doing that. So just just as a recap for, for those people who may not know about the Reform Temple, tell me a little bit about them and just as a whole what they're all about. Well, we've been in the village for about 27 years now. Mm -hmm. um, we have a wonderful rabbi, Joe Mendelson, and a cantor who comes to us twice a month. Mm -hmm. We have a large congregation who thinks of themselves as family, and that's how we, w we like it. Yeah. Um, we have services every Friday night in Clubhouse One mm -hmm. at 7.30, mm -hmm. and anyone in the village is welcome to attend. Right. Beverly is always really key on letting people know about the Shabbat services, and that's yes. on Friday. And, uh, and then I was just talking to you a little bit off camera that you just had an event not too long ago where everybody could bake challah bread. That's and right. I understand that was very popular. It was. <laughs> that is great. That was great. Carol, I'm still waiting for my olive bread. <laughs> In any case, so the so June or April 30th, you have the uh, Jewish Food Festival. So what is it all about? Okay, this is the third time that we are presenting the Jewish Food Festival in the village. Mm -hmm. It's April 30th, as you said. It starts at five o'clock and it ends at eight o'clock mm -hmm. and it amazes me that for three hours we've been working on this since <laughs> January. Um, we have a wide variety of food available. It, the food is all for sale, but admission to the event is free. Right. Um, all the Jewish organizations in the village come together to participate in this event. Mm -hmm. So it's not just the Reform Temple, that is selling food, but the other organizations as well. Oh, that's great. So uh, when you say selling food, so what kind of food are we looking at? Dinner or snacks or desserts? Uh, sandwiches primarily. Okay. We have pastrami on rye. Oh, I just had that the other day. Um, brisket sandwiches mm -hmm. on a Kaiser roll. Mm -hmm. We have lox and bagel mm -hmm. with cream cheese, um, kosher hot dogs, barbecued. And we have a really big variety of, uh, of baked goods that the men and women in the temple have been baking for a while and freezing. So we have really a lot of food. And you've brought some samples here of some of the delicious desserts where I have right in front of me to taste. So tell me about what you have with you. Okay, I have Mandelbrot, okay. which is called um, it translates almond bread, but All right. this has walnuts in it, which okay. is also fine. Okay. Uh, and a sour cream coffee cake. A sour cream coffee cake. You know, I, I made this many times. It was It's called suck it to me cake. Oh, okay. <laughs> in, in addition, we have uh, rugelach oh, and good. chocolate babka and Russian cookies. Oh, wow. Don't ask me about those. I haven't, <laughs> I haven't uh, made those yet. Um, mm, that's so good. But they're packaged so that people can take them home, mm -hmm. eat them there. Mm -hmm. In addition to the things I've mentioned, um, we're going to have bottled water and soda. Mm -hmm. And uh, the Shalom Club is selling egg creams. Oh, interesting. Which has, it's a drink with no egg. It, <laughs> oh, but it's called egg cream. <laughs> uh, it's a New York deli thing. It's um, right. club soda sparkling water, and oh. chocolate sauce. Oh, well, it sounds really yes. interesting. Oh. And uh, Ort is selling noodle kugel, oh. which is really delicious. Okay. And uh, we're going to have hummus and pita for sale, mm -hmm. and halava, okay. and uh, Hadassah is selling their cookbooks. Oh, nice. Oh, that's great. And another, there's a lot of highlights to this event. Um, we have a klezmer band. Yep. And they play throughout the event, except when they take a break 
and we have Israeli dancing led by Rebecca Galad. <gasps> wow, I didn't know she's a dancer. Oh, nice. she's a wonderful dancer, okay. and she's a wonderful teacher, and she's going to be teaching line dancing. Oh, that's great. And we have a, a, a sleight of hand close up musician, mm. Nate Kavetny. Okay. And he'll be walking around the tables. Okay. And uh, it, we have an amazing silent auction with over, well over a hundred items and gift cards. Right, well now you do have a slide here that talks about all of your sponsors. And I'm imagining that a majority of those sponsors are the ones that are providing some of those goodies, is that correct? No, Oh, not really. Our members have either purchased gift cards oh. or uh, had them donated. And okay. these are the amazing people who have helped us underwrite the event. Oh good, there you go. Perfect, and they've all helped you out. And yes. like you said, there's an awful lot that goes on, and that's like you've been preparing since January yes. for your three day, your three hours of an yes. event. <laughs> well, it takes a lot; it really does, especially to get everybody together to cooperate and make all of this delicious food. That is true. Okay. Um, parking, when we've done this before, has been a problem. So this year, we have contracted with Agewell okay. and hired a minibus and that will be bringing people from Clubhouse 4 parking lot mm -hmm. to Clubhouse 1 and okay. it will run a continual circuit. Perfect. So if people come to Clubhouse 4 and they don't see the the bus, it's on its way back. Yeah, it'll just make a yeah. circle. Okay, yeah. all right. So that's a good thing. Fantastic. And. Um, we got smart because we've had so many long lines of people waiting to buy tickets. Mm -hmm. So this year we're selling tickets ahead of time as well as okay. at the event for okay. the food. Okay. And that's t going on um, most mornings between 10 and noon in the Clubhouse One drop-in lounge. Oh, okay, good, because that, that would be important to know where that is. Well, fantastic. Yes. Well, thank you so much. Good luck. Let's just remind everybody again, it's April 30th, and uh, you can get tickets, like you mentioned. And tell me again those hours. 10 to, to noon, mm -hmm. most mornings between now and the festival, All right. um, in Clubhouse One's drop-in lounge. Clubhouse One drop-in lounge. All right. Well, fantastic. Well, thank you again. Good luck to you, and thanks for bringing in the goodies. You are welcome. Thank you. Thank you. If you want more information about the festival, you can always go to the LagunaWoodsVillage.com website and look for Reform Temple of Laguna Woods, and they'll have the Jewish Food Festival information online. We'll be right back. <music>